Question for Shane. This is coming again from Illmatic. This is a crazy question. If Shane could snatch up any or every Canadian artist or producer and put them on one <laughs> huge monster roster, who would they be and what would his rationale be for adding each individual to that team? You know what? <laughs> Outside of who you have, right. pick another artist that you're not working with. Pick another producer you're not working with. Okay. Outside okay. of Rochester, Medic, Lincoln, and Javon yeah. Foundation. <laughs> and of course... Right. The production team told Mason. It, exactly. Pick one artist, one producer. One artist and one producer. Well, production-wise, I would have to go with probably Soundsmith, Boy Wonder, Snaz. Those are three production teams. Either of those there. guys. Okay. Right. Uh, in terms of artists, I would definitely have to talk about my boy Drake, my boy Era, my boy Ken Masters, my man Tona, my man Mayhem. Um, you got to pick one. <laughs> <laughs> one? One. Oh, no. <sighs> man... See, it's like real, real hard just because in, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me explain because in terms of putting together our artists with foundation is that we, I personally feel that we have Medic who's a real grimy street cat. Then we got Javon who's 15, totally different flavor. We, yeah. we got Lincoln who's set, he just turned 17 actually, right Lincoln? Yeah. Just turned 17 who's like on some introspective intelligence stuff. Like this guy knows stuff that like most 17 year olds don't know. Then we got Juice and you know what he brings. So who would you, know you pick? I mean? So it's like out, <laughs> no, like out there. It's like you have cats that kind of play in each of those lanes. Yeah. Right. So there's no one really that I would want to pick. There's artists that I respect and uh, and appreciate, and I would work with. And those are the artists that I that I just named. Oh, the manager. Oh, the manager. No, I'm diplomat. I'm, I'm, I'm dead serious because there'd be guys that would basically be in the same lanes that those four cats are in. Oh, that was yeah. a great answer. Great answer. Thank you very much. You'll do good in politics, exactly. brother. <laughs> um, shocks, man. So okay. In terms of the album, yes. obviously the question is, it, how's it looking? Well, the album... The you album, heard the one single, then we heard the, as well the Heavy Petters single. Yeah, the Heavy Petters is a whole other thing, though. Yeah, That's not okay. part of my album. That's part of their album. Um, but with me, yeah, I got the album coming. We had the song Weekend uh, with Carl Wolf that did really well for me. Much love to everybody that uh, really helped out with that one. Cashmere, she did a great job on the visuals on that. Um, right now, we're about to go and drop a brand new single. Uh, it's called What I Do. That's going to be the next single you're about to hear. The album is going to be coming on a little bit later this year. Unfortunately, I know it sounds like the same talk, but business got to be correct. And that's why the record was delayed from coming out last year. Um, also, what I wanted to say, too, is because what I'm about to be bringing out and bringing forth to What's this that? Toronto scene coming right now. There's been the buzz about it. I People hit me up about it. And what I wanted to do and accompany it with is to go in a company with Toronto with its very own brand new entrepreneurial vibe from Shaw Claire, which is my new health beverage called right. Skyline yeah. with the Toronto Skyline on it. And I want to let you know, see, some people talk about people trying a thing. This is me doing it. Right. This drink is coming out in Nigeria, in Brazil, with the Brazilian Skyline on that one. Mexico with the Mexico City Skyline on and uh, you know, and in Canada and in the U.S., I partnered up with the people, the same partners uh, that do Pimp Juice, Nelly's people. That's where there's a song I did with uh, Murphy Lee. I, I did a track with him, but that came out of that. But um, you know, so I wanted to align it all with that because this next move that you see, it like I told you, I've been chilling for a minute. I yeah. did life, I did family. Yeah. So now when I when you see me again coming next year, I just was starting sticking my head out the hole. When you see me now next year. This is me doing more than just music. Music right. is my fries. Right. I'm about to give you the McDLT and the Big <laughs> Mac and the Quarter Pounder and even the toy that comes with the Nuggets. That's all happening next year. And with, with the healthy All right, drink. all right. We're looking forward to that. <laughs> yeah. Mr. Sterling. Yeah, with the health drink. With the, the health drink on the side. Mr. Sterling.